A California man is being held right now on a $500,000 bond charged with threatening terrorism and possessing explosives. He was arrested just hours after telling the manager of a local bar about his plan. Fox News' Alexis Wiley spoke to the man who many are calling a hero tonight. He was serious and he was in a jubilant mood. Joe Nahas manages Detroit's J.S. Fields Pub and Grill. He says 63-year-old Roger Stockham came into his bar last Monday, and like most people do at bars, he struck up a conversation. But Nahas says this conversation was by no means innocent. He was serious about an explosion tonight. Nahas says Stockham then gave him a job to do. He wanted to leave a package with me to give it to the press after the explosion. But Nahas had no intention of accepting any package. I kept talking to him and I informed my chef to go find the webpage for national security. Nahas called Detroit police, who then contacted Dearborn PD. Police spotted Stockham outside the Islamic Center of America last Monday evening, wearing a ski mask with a car full of M80s and fireworks, enough to do serious damage. Stockham is accused of driving from California to Dearborn to target this mosque. Sources say he planned to flee to Canada after the explosion. And this isn't the first time he's been accused of making threats. He served time in a federal prison for threatening to kill President Bush and threatening to blow up a Vermont veterans clinic. He was released in 2005. Stockham does have a history of mental illness, but Daoud Walid, executive director of the Council on American Islamic Relations, says that doesn't make this man any less of a threat. Such behavior is not tolerated against any group of people at any house of worship. This is totally unacceptable. It's criminal and it's un-American. But thankfully, Nahas had the courage to speak up and stop Stockham from fulfilling his sinister plan. My honest belief is that everything he said, he was serious about it. There is a difference between you joking and uh, this was not a joke. Stockham will be in court this upcoming Friday. In Dearborn, I'm Alexis Wiley, Fox 2 News.